in this video i'm checking out diana ankudinova this is from the channel diana ankudinova live life um it's called city of people in love i haven't seen this i haven't heard this so if you're a big fan of diana smash like and subscribe let's go следующую композицию я никогда не пела пела я ее вот сейчас вот в гримерке один раз Естественно, я очень волнуюсь, потому что очень нестандартная для меня песня, но я очень люблю ее слушать. The last time she sang this was in the dressing room. That's what she just said. Okay. Okay. Yeah, she was very right. This doesn't sound like a standard song. <laughs> That's quite the intro. Okay. Есть на далекой планете город влюбленных людей. Звезды для них по особому светят, небо для них голубей. Белые стены над морем, белый покой и уют. Люди не ссорятся, люди не спорят. This is a technical song. Hey, the, the way she pronounces the words and delivers some of the notes. Hey. Люди не ссорятся, люди не спорят. Люди друг другу поют. Посидим, помолчим, все само пройдет. Застает гнев и печаль уйдет. Если тот город увидишь. Сразу обиды простишь, Словом напрасным меня не обидишь, Ссорою не оскорбишь. Путь нам навеки осветит Белого города свет. Пусть говорят, что на нашей планете Этого города нет. Посиди. I get, I get why Diana was saying that this song made her worried to perform. I, I get, I get it because it has, it's, it has like a. I don't know the original song. I don't know the original song, but it sounds like a fusion of like something that you'd hear like an opera singer doing with like a jazz type vibe. Yeah. So it has like all this like very delicate notes that you have to do correctly. Otherwise, if you do it wrongly, the song just sounds out of tune and out of place. I get it now. <laughs> I 
know it's not opera. I know, I know it's not opera. I know you're wondering why is he talking about opera. I know it's not opera, but in in opera, when you hear, especially like women sing like slower songs in opera, they always try to hit like these notes, certain notes specifically, so that the song actually is delivered properly. That's what I'm. That's what I'm comparing it to. Very much jazz type influence. This girl can sing many genres. She, she can't, I know her genres are like rock, folk, and pop, but she can sing many things well. Yeah? I don't know if you can see the person behind, I don't know if it's behind or on the side to Diana, just in camera on the side is just smiling because of how impressed they are as they are singing this song. Let me rewind, let me rewind. Look at the person who's just behind on the side, on the side of Diana. Just they are smiling. That was a technical song. It required certain precision delivery because most of the notes are very low and silent. So if you do them wrong, it's very easy for someone to hear that, oh, you messed up right there. Yeah, I've never heard the original version of this song. Maybe you can comment below and give me more information about it. But Diana's performance of it to me was pristine and precise. Let me say it like that. Pristine and precise. And I've enjoyed that. Hmm. If you're a big fan of Diana, make sure to smash like and subscribe. Uh, this channel, Diana Ankudin Over Life, has a lot of content that I am, I am yet to go through, so expect more. And then uh, on this screen, I'll leave other reactions I've done for Diana. Many others. It is such a long list of Diana reactions. And then I'll see you in the next one.